Hello, this is Old Crow Belzer, and welcome to Belzer Strategic Arcana. So this is my continuing multiplayer match versus Pavi of Strategic Command, World War II, World at War. Should be turned 77. I think we're going into July 1945. Historically, Germany, Germany had bit the dust. Well, Germany hasn't bit the dust here. Germany is still strong. And they're going to be tough to take down. So I have General Patton, who I think is personally, there's a lot of people, including some close friends of mine, who think he is like God's gift to women. I don't, I don't think so. Now I do, I do enjoy the fact that he, uh, he believed in reincarnation. Uh, I do too. However, that doesn't mean that we're buddies. Drinking buddies? Definitely not. He's definitely not the Soviet, Soviet Union's uh, savior. Though he will be in this game. Or in this alternative history. Anyway, I digress. It's super late here and up in the Cascades. We have gone through unprecedented snow. And we get a lot of snow. Anyway, let's see what happens here. Because Italy just fell. He's going to try to transform out. Oh, good move. Oh, Pavia. That was that was a killer move. You got him out. I thought I had him trapped. There we go. Yeah, the Soviet Union is still in, in huge jeopardy. I was mentioning Patton because we uh, Patton's offensive in Italy down in the fall. And we didn't have to assault Sicily and all that. Now it's July too, so there's a lot of good weather. Moscow still could fall. I have to be very careful what I do here. Let's see if it's I am certain that he's going to do everything he can to get to Moscow. As a matter of fact, at the peril of losing uh, the Western Front. I have no fighters here who can go after his bombers. All of his fighters are in the West. I think he's going to go infantry strong on Moscow. Every time he brings pandas up, we kill him. Or we hurt him really bad. However, his infantry is really hard to handle. Now, there is a Romanian. There he goes. See? He's on Moscow now. I'm glad I did Operation Embassy. He's going on Gorky, too. He's going to throw everything he's got at us because he knows. See if you move in. Took Seroff yet. Yeah. I'm kind of surprised about that. I'm trying to get to Seroff. I can't put any units in Seroff. They're cut off from the artificial base. So, what we got to do is we got to make them scared. I think he brought some armor over there, I don't know. Oh, we got that as well. Oh, great. I worked with Venezuela and Army Intelligence. Back in the late 80s and early 90s. That's all I gotta say about that. For now. Maybe Dark Taboo could could fill us in. All right. So he took back Sofia again. Tehran's captured. Yeah, that was an Italian. Uh, Albania was Italian. Bulgaria surrendered. Hmm. I 
this is going to be a long term. I have to really consider what we're going to do here. All right, that's for the United States. That's fine. For the Soviets. Yeah. So my armor has not done well. Soviet armor against the Germans. Let's go take a look at everything before I can do what I want to do, which I'm not sure of. Yeah, we're going to have to try to snuff this. That means moving. Oy, 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 oy. These are just trial. Yeah, this is a danger here. I've got... Uh, I only have an entrenchment in a one, so there's nothing to lose here in Moscow. We have to kill this. He's really close to Gorky. I wanted to be able to put extra units here and start pushing again on him. Cut railroads, do whatever we can. He's got an army here. I would like to put a unit here. Oh, well, it's a little late now, huh? Progress. Looks like he's pulled out down here. But we're weak. So this is pretty much uh, going to be an Indian Army thing. I've got South Africans here. I've got an Australian here. Looks like I lost all my Indian troops. <laughs> Still busy securing everything here, which we can do. Looks like we're going to be able to take Rome. So I Italy will be on our side. I need to see what's going on here. He's not going to pull off anything here. No, look at that. That's that's interesting. Why is this so strong? I can't even get a hit but my uh, Soviets. Uh, could be uh, HQ attachments. I'm not sure. I have that's Hungarian too. I've got two that can go and strike them. Yeah, this is gonna be this is gonna take some time. So what do we got out here going now? I got another ABL. And special forces. This is Klaus Schultz, by the way. Uh, got quite a few people that like uh, Tangerine Dream. Huh. Let's go look at it over here. All right. So I got almost more than enough to take out this if we need to. If you want to take any damage. We're closing in on uh, Hanoi. They're strong though. Let's see what's this fight now? Three. Yeah, we just gotta work them. He's got one HQ left. This AVL has used up its strikes, so I'm gonna send him west. Yeah, I think we got him. Let's go look at uh, next in August. We should get the decision to be these atomic weapons. Let's see where the Japanese are right now. It's an epic game. We still, uh, Soviet Union still may fall. Okay, so the Japanese are at 13%. So I dropped the first two atomic bombs. That'll be on Hiroshima and Nagasaki. There is a third for Osaka. I think that comes in September. That should be enough. Take out Japan. Now, I actually don't want to go after Mongolia. This is our earlier version too. I'd probably have Mongolia in the war. It's pro-Soviet. In this in this version, it only starts at like 20, 20% or something. Again, let's go look at diplomacy again. But uh, in the new version, it starts 75%, which makes percent uh, more sense. Yeah, 20%. 
So I'd make them Soviet just to put some pressure here because they were pro-Soviet, fought the Japanese here on uh, Nomenhan in this area right here, 1939. That was Zukov. Zukov made his bones, man. I'm on a settlement here. I'm going to go ahead and see if I can... Yeah, I'm going to march him up, try to get to here. But all the rest of these guys are going to be in Irkutsk. And I'm going to try to get one here. And everybody else is going to cover. Let's go look. So let's do this right now. Okay, Cheetah. Yeah, these, these right here. Okay. So these, if the Soviet does, Soviet does fall, these will be German. I, don't, I doubt he's going to give them to the Japanese. Uh, yeah. But I have this, I have this force right here to go after Mongolia. I may just go ahead and do it. I think it's going to depend on what we can do here. Uh, usually I leave the Soviets for last, but I think we're going to do the Soviets first because that's going to dictate some other things that we're going to do here. Yeah. So let's go ahead. Let's go look at purchases. Well, not for the job, our Chinese. All right, this is July 13, so I get all this. This is August, so I get two armies next turn. So there's two armies and a heavy tank. Let's go. Uh, okay. Let's go look at research. Yeah, we're way behind here. Catch-up bonuses aren't really doing, working out well. We need to take this out. Zero entrenchment. Hmm. All right. Well, that's my best commander. I need an HQ, don't I? Some damage goods there. I got two armies now. No. I have nothing. I can't reach this guy either. That's fine. Okay, so Zukov. Oh, sorry. Maybe I gotta get you down. Yeah, I could use one another HQ down south, right? Yeah. Let's recheck this. I think I'm gonna move you.
attach you, put you on. Take you off. Put you on. Okay. Yeah, one right here. Candle lock. Okay, let's make sure everybody's covered here. I could use the unit here to keep doing keep the pressure. We did take Gary out of. Alright. Got 1037. So yeah. We're gonna attack this right now. I have one shell. We're gonna shoot. We got bad weather here, that's fine. So good. Hmm. Well, it is not so good. See what his game is here. Now oh, I might just fall for this bit. No entrenchment. Cannot swap. I can't get in there either. No, we need an aircraft. Damn, his infantry, man.
that's what we gotta do. Okay. Crazy times. He take this with this infantry if he just piles it on that's what he's gonna do right oh uh, yeah it's so close we just killed another panzer we got two more on Gorky you're going in with your infantry I'm gonna put you. You have no more. You have no more. I don't think you have any more armor here. You got it here. I'm gonna put it here on Gorky. This other army. you flinch how am I gonna make you flinch man Jesus cronies I got a pilot on here okay Americans yeah everybody now how much have I got left let's go ahead and reinforce everybody It's a shock army. Yeah, I can't put mobility on those suckers. That's fine. These guys on their own can't handle his infantry. Let's upgrade this mobility. Let's go ahead and cut him. Oh shit. So he does got on there. Well at least we know. Right? Nice reserve uh, there, Pavia. Okay, let's see, 905, what can we fix? Uh, yeah, wow, look at this. If only I had decent air power. I mean, it's gotta have something there. Let's just reinforce it then.
He don't got no fighters here, right? No, he doesn't. Yeah, let's we'll start flying, guys. Oh, we still want to see this. Is there anything in town? He doesn't have anything in town. Okay, how can I work this? How do we wait? I don't have anything that I can... Damn. I can get in town and flank him. So it's going to have to be next turn. Hopefully he didn't notice that. Yeah, it can't be from here. It's got to be from here. Could be from here, but that might make Moscow because his air power. Yeah. We could do it from here, though. Now, let's buy units. I need some quick ones. Okay, army. Mobility up. Yeah, mobility is ex freaking expensive, yeah. Look at this. So all armies. If we could break through the Talon, I should have known. I should have put, save one unit for up there to cover a, a Narva. Take Talon, and he's gonna. You'd have to cover that too. I have two. Two, two MVPs left. Okay, that's it. Damn, man. See, I don't have to buy another HQ since I have this guy here. No. We brought this in here. He probably is going to tear it up. He's going to have to pull back and tear it up or bring something in. He doesn't know exactly what's going on here. Man, if I moved here, let's go look at this closer. I don't want moving in Narva. I don't have anything spare to cover except for this. He, he could come right in here, so we can't do that. I do have, oh, now I can't, uh, let's see. No. So I don't have anything that I can, that's fine. We were looking at that last turn. And now, Let's go look at uh, let's go look at Soviet skin next turn. It's just two armies and a garrison. Even place an army in Narva and sending that. Yeah, that could turn them upside down. Maybe. I don't know. Pavia is pretty determined to take Moscow. <sighs> let's go over here first. No steal with the Japanese. I'm sure this has got to be depressing. I don't think I need these, some of these guys. I think we're going to get them the ports.
don't need you anymore. Got good weather here. He's got fighters. I don't need to lose money over that. I don't think so. There's gonna be there's two fighter units. It's gonna be a bunch of interceptions. We don't need to do that. So let's go look at China. 366. Let's look at their research. I think we're going to go and attack Mongolia. Because Moscow could fall. And if they do, we got to get in there quick. Into eastern Siberia, right? That's what I think. So let's go look at China. Whoop. That's not China. That's Hong Kong. Well, kind of Hong Kong. It's got a Union Jack, right? So amphibious warfare. we got two chits. We're moving along. Industrial attack. We're all maxed out here. Well, let's go. Let's go with advanced fighters. We're going to do one. That's fine. Now I'm going to go ahead and purchase a, a, my broken fighter that I've had since the beginning of the game. Yeah. I, I don't need a garrison. I don't think. Okay. Now. I should have a fighter unit here, yeah, because I could fly him into. I could fly him in. Oh, you're rumpshy. Oh, uh, wait. 64, yeah, we can't do anything. Could get a garrison, don't need to do that. Because I could get a unit here. It'd be nice to have a unit here. It'll cut the. There's, there's two rail lines. If he takes all this, Tashkent is the key here to keep him out of Iran, at least from this avenue. Kashgar. Oh. Let's go ahead and buy a garrison. And we'll put it in Kashgar. I'll put it on my notes so I could. It's communist Chinese that being Yan'an. Okay, cool. I think we're going to declare war on, on uh, Mongolia right now, just to perturb them. And if we take Mongolia and be pro axis, we'll get a little boost. And I got to check. Let's go check the Soviet uh, NM. It's going to continue. It's going to keep sinking be just because of the fact that he's got my other uh, capitals. Yeah, it's 37. So we're losing a, like 2% a turn or maybe even more depending on losses. So eventually they're, they're going to surrender no matter what. Unless he leaves off and we can get an NM. They're gonna they're gonna fold. So we're gonna go ahead. You know, my my favorite countries I studied for years and years uh, Central Asian history and Alain Batar. If you go to Alain Batar, right after the fall of the Soviet Union and they became Western, 1991, we called it Ulan Bazaar. It was crazy. There was a company called Moncor got involved with. They wanted Western investments. Yeah, Dr. Smith, if you watch this, you can, if you want to talk about how, what Mongolia was like, it was always been the Wild West, but it really became the Wild West after the, throughout the, the communist system, which actually did good, did them good for a while, but they were under the Soviet yoke, but I digress. All right, we're going to declare war on them. Yeah, this might have repercussions against the Soviet Union, I hope not, we'll check. Flag too. So we got Bayan Ua. Let's bring you in. So you spy. I have a game called Objective Moscow SPI. We used to just play, it, the maps are huge, it covered a whole pool table. And we used to play the futuristic uh, battle between uh, a resurgent Russia or USSR and China and Mongolia. This whole this whole area was just fascinating. And I, I still have the game. <laughs>
and we have new I don't know if I can put it on YouTube yet but we have new uh oh I can't bring you bring you in okay that's fine I have a new uh new uh, scenario involved let's go let's go look at yeah it's late okay so that's gonna bring me up to eight five five I don't want them attacking, attacking this and killing it. Let's bring that up. Oh yeah, yeah, we can't bring the parsons in. Yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna build a chain here. We'll see. Let's bring it up. Yeah, we take a one in there, so. It's, so Pavia you have you have a new access partner for a little while. And with this we can completely block this in case the Soviet Union falls right here. You get units in here. It's gonna be key if I can get Omaha to Tashkent or Tashkent actually. But I mean I have to build units and actually move them. You go after this bit, yeah. Oh, we hit it. Once we hit. No. Uh, I really don't want to lose any money. I know I'm greedy. We got enough here. Not it's ran. No. Okay. So let's get some. Use on my Chinese money. Now we can stay here. I think I forgot to move a few things here. Yeah, even after all this time, I am not sure. About Russia or the Soviet Union. This is Baya. Yeah, if they fall. It's gonna be real it's it's a real interesting game as it is. If they fall, yeah. Okay, so let's go over to the ETO now. Let's look down here. I got an AVL. It's got a strike. I'm running these transports. I have an AVL here. That's Bradley. Yeah, I put him on, and I, we really are going to need a.
Yeah, we need an HQ here. That means shifting air units too. I bet he, he's got some here. Holy moly, what are we going to do here? He's got beat to hell. Let's go ahead and reinforce this. Yeah, we went through some shit, didn't we? Okay, that's right. Let's reinforce what we can. We got time. And yeah, we're doing pretty damn good, aren't we? He rotated too. Nothing there. Anti aircraft, anti aircraft, anti aircraft. Let's go look at purchases, uh, production for the United States. Okay, that's coming in August, September, all tanks. Okay. Let's look at Great Britain for next turn. That's in, right, next turn. All right. Let's look at research for the United States, or Britain first. Okay, advanced fighters are gonna be four pretty soon. That's great. Got to try to figure out how to overwhelm the Luftwaffe. We're going to have to flank him in himself. Because he's going to maul my ass. And on Tanaka, I mean Pavia, sorry. Not Tanaka, Pavia. He's determined he's got to take out Russia. Or Soviet Union. I still think it's going to be a, a stalemate. Uh, I have to take Paris. I don't even know how I'm going to pull that off yet. We do got, well, I'll tell May of 1947. Logistics only have two. But I need to churn out. We're at 735. This is the United States, so we're, we're away from uh, Tank 4. Let's go look at the British again. Okay. Well, we got to do something here. Let's take care of... Uh, kind of hits a little... I wonder if he's bringing any Luftwaffe units down here. I guess we could find out, huh? To go auto. See if we can get it. Okay, there's no sign. Let's burn them down. We can do it. Yeah. Three. I didn't see how many. God damn. Let's go see how many. We gotta see how many he's got. Okay. He's gonna go bomb these suckers down. Let's do this. Finish. I do a game with somebody else. I'm gonna, uh, well, even if I'm Axis. Let's go here. There's any air there. Might 
minus four. Maybe I can bomb these guys. I don't know how. God. Hmm, I could do some head hurting there. Well, Bradley, I gotta get you in. That's a dilemma. That's not a dilemma. We got that port. Now, that's good. And you know, fire down here. Hmm.
Well, I'm glad I didn't pull that one off yet. He's got something there. Okay. That's mine too. I wonder if he's got something else to say. No, that's damn Turkish. Okay. That's fine. Another AVL with a strike. Special Forces India can't do anything yet. We moved them. Okay. Wasted all these guys. Let's go ahead so we can bomb them down a little bit. But what? Innsbruck. Yeah, we use that. I think all of his uh, fighters are. Let's blow it. Isolate it. God damn. He's got him all the way out. This one got shot up. Let's go ahead and tackle him. Jeez. That's not working out. Slim, I don't know where we're going to put you yet. We already got an Indian with some. Let's keep you in stir for a little bit. We might have to get you in the Middle East. All right, let's see what we can do here with Patton. American. Oh, I can't really cover there. Uh, I'm not going to need you. I don't think we're going to need you. We're going to need you. You. Yeah, okay. Now, 
this is MacArthur. Can we reach here? Oh, we can. Uh, boy. Let's take this one off. Put you on. Let's look at Eisenhower. Though. Yeah, I don't have enough. Yet. I need another HQ. I got one I just bought. Let's take you off. Put you on. Okay, I got two of them. Take the bomber off. Put the army on. We'll replace this. Oh my goodness. Take him down is going to be hard. All right, Patton. Could of course cover here. Why don't we do that? This is a uh, and this is Gort. All right, now let's see. We got extras. Yeah, we want this bomber. We want these bombers. Okay, we'll figure it out. So because we want to advance in here, we want to take Genoa. Or what? What are we going to do here, George? George Patton. Let's reinforce you. I got a feeling we're going to need you up north. Okay. We don't know what's here. Let's go find out. Hmm. Okay, now we know. Bomber's gonna have to just deal with it. His trench was, uh, he's still got a big morale. Okay. Brutal. Germans, man. Yeah, that's dangerous enough that I don't want to do that. Hoi, hoi, hoi. Freaking tank waiting. Now this is the breakthrough we need right here. So we gotta what? Put an army. Now you have another strike. I know. Let's bring Platt in here just for supply. Yeah. Okay. No, I don't want to lose the shells.
All right, here. Okay, use that up. Let's see if it's good. All right. That's crazy, man. Talking nuts, man. What are we gonna do here? attack here or whatever. They might attack here too. No, let's put the pressure on him.
Wow. I'm going to send the special forces. I don't look viable, man. It's going to have to be down here in the med. Got a lot of units here. That's good. All right. do a Copenhagen Gambit so let's get the best ships I got you're gonna keep watching the, this okay that's the other HQ I need okay Much, but, well, it is. If there is a loose sub, this is a, truly a huge amount of money. Okay. Yeah. Six ninety five. Six ninety five. Same price. All right. So if we do a Copenhagen, we're going to, that's going to be a while. Let's go ahead and let's get you up by an HQ. Uh, you're good. Oh. Japanese are bay. You I just got you here. I actually really need this. <laughs> uh, there's so much going on here. Again, if the Soviet Union falls, and it still could. I'm a little subdued because there's so much going on here. Let's go back up here. I would love to put a core in here. Him up. Can't do anything. No. Uh, you know, I might be able to use this stuff down the south. Yep. Let's start moving, guys. That's all about here. Okay, we gotta start purchasing. I already looked at research. We're covered here in case of a gambit. I got a core down here. I don't know how Japanese could do a gambit, but they could. Okay. Yeah, let's purchase. And let's see. Let's go purchase for the Americans. Let's go back to the Americans. Let's look at production. What do I got cooking? Tanks. Okay. Here we go, boys. Do I really need a core? Not really. Do I need an engineer? Kind of nice. I could dig somewhere with paratroopers. Tactical bomber. That'd be 1946 February. Pretty soon we're gonna wind down to the last year. It's gonna be a while. 
it's May 1947. This is only July. Huh. We got everything we need, I think. An extra tactical bomber. I'm gonna go ahead and buy the strategic bomber. No, I'm gonna buy the, I'm gonna buy the paratroopers. Yep. And I'm going, yeah. Yeah, we're gonna need it. Look at research. I could save it for the strategic bomber next turn. I am going to take casualties. Or I could buy that core. No. Can't do anything. Do I really need to replace the core? Against these Germans? No. No, against the Germans, it's going to be the strategic bomber and tactical bomber. Okay, so we're going to save that. British. Let's look at research again one last time for the British. Yeah, we're crawling here. There's nothing else we can do. Uh, amphibious warfare. We're doing the last chit. I don't even think that's necessary. I think we just need to keep. Uh, these are worthless, fortunately. And the tank two ain't gonna do nothing. That'd be in December for next year. We'll just keep buying armies. Hmm. Well, or tanks. I'm gonna buy these tanks. Or one anyway. Paratrooper. That's it. That's our Huckleberry. Yeah, I made a decision a long time ago. I think I will change it up a little bit. I didn't get an armor as soon as I wanted to or fighters. But I was playing the long game, but I thought I thought it'd be better. Better off right now, but that's fine. This is good. Okay, so we got that. Can't do anything about the French, so we're saving this money. We're gonna buy strategic bombers and repair anything we got and buy more stuff. We got paratroopers coming pretty soon. Okay, so any sh stuff, let's see. Supplies good, supplies good, supplies good. Let's just move stuff around a little bit. Might come out on a last fury. Yeah, I would. Maybe. You. Yeah, I was speaking. Of He's going to see all that. I think that I got ships down there. I don't need these. Let's bring everybody up. Yep. Very good. I'll keep a few here. Hmm. Yeah, let's get you out. Yeah, we can keep a few here. Let's go here. All right, that's it. Hell of a game. Pavi, I salute you. <clears throat> Caucus 
this one more time. Yeah, I would love to put some there. I can't. He might come out, come across, but he's gonna have to come across on a swamp. Let's do this. Okay. It's all about the bluff, you know. Let's do this. You just kind of run around. Let's pick it up. This is close, man. This is like Chunk King. Earlier when I was on down a few points, he might be able to storm this. If he does, we're screwed. But I don't know what else I can do. I've done everything I could. Can't want another armor yet. This might be a toast. He might be able to take Moscow back. I have no idea how strong this guy is. Uh, there's nothing. There's nothing I can do to get in here. Just keep the guy out. No. Nope. Alright. That's it. End turn. I got church and huh? It's got effect the Germans. Hey, Owen. Hey. Man, storms are hurting us worse than Japanese. Must be the divine win. Right, here we go. 999 for the Soviets. Wowza. All right. Well, this is Okro Balzar. Thanks for watching. Pavia, it's your turn. You might be able to take Moscow after all the frustrations that you've had to deal with. If you do, you deserve it. This is Okro Balzar. See you on the virtual battlefield. I am gone.